Okay, my dudes, oh, what is up? And we are here with some more card fight Vanguard openings for you guys. Now, this is the rebooted version, the uh, V version right here. And uh, guys, what is in this little package right here is one of the most epic things I've seen. Well, technically I haven't actually seen it with my own eyes yet. It's still sealed. It's still sealed. I have not even opened it yet. So uh, it's going to be other than pictures. I'm actually going to see these for the first ever time. Now to get this, it was actually an event that was only held in uh, the United States of America. So there was no way for anyone to get it unless you wanted to pay money to get it over from there. And uh, yo, I'm just so excited. All right, anyway, so let's open this up. Um, all right, so guys, basically, you know, when there's more like releases on a Vanguard and stuff, I always do at least one opening uh, because I absolutely love Vanguard and I like to get you guys into the things that I like as well because uh, it's awesome to try new stuff, you know? Oh, come on, man, we need to get this out. I like, look at this, I like, there's a the little bit of it right here and I need to get it all. All right, here we go, slowly. This is just like, oh wow. You don't understand how long I've been waiting for this, guys. So long right now. If you love Vanguard, oh, ho, 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 ho. there it is. There, there's Aichi, Aichi Sendo. Here he is, and then we got, oh, wow. 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 That looks phenomenal. No, guys, that looks absolutely Phenomenal. Look at that. All right, so I, I basically, I forgot to tell you, it's actually like Q4 versus AL4. Um, but wow. Look, oh, holy moly, donut shop. Look at this. You got Blaster Dark, Blaster Blade, and Dragonic Overlord are right there. That is wow. No, no, no. Oh, guys, I need to zoom in right here. Look at this. Look at the artwork of that. Blast of Blade oh, Look at this! Even Blast of Dark looks insane. This is the whole reason why I got it because this artwork is actually on the cards and they are what I'm going to be adding to my clans because I actually built all three of these decks. There's actually more cards in there as well. I think they've got all special edition cards from um, all of Q4 and AL4 as well. So eight different clans with different cards to check out. And uh, yo, this is wow, wow. I feel, I, you know, guys, you don't understand. I feel so special right now. I feel so special right now to have this in my hands. It's absolutely, I don't even want to open it. I do want to open it, but I don't want to open it at the same time. Oh, oh, it's basically just ripped it anyway. All right, let's just open, let's just get it out. Let's just get it out because I can't wait no more to see the actual cards. Whoa, it's even more shiny. Look at that. I need to look one more time at this. Wait, a card just fell out. Uh oh, a card. Pale Moon card just came out there. Wow. Guys, look at that. No, that looks insane. All right, let's open this together. Let's push this down here. Let's open this up. Whoa, that looks phenomenal. That looks phenomenal. All right, wait, I'm going to get like. Each half of you got, oh, oh, there's Overlord. Look, there is, oh, there's Overlord, guys. Look at, I'm gonna get close ups anyway, don't worry, guys. Let me just put these all back in here. And then uh, I'm gonna get them out after as well and show you guys what they look like. Oh, ho, 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 ho. yo, Amaterasu right there. Even though it would have been nice to actually have that as a Imperial Daughter, that would have been better, to be honest with you. But uh, it still looks. Absolutely phenomenal. Oh, they're actually markers. Wow. Yes. That looks cool. That, that looks so cool. All right, all right, all right. Now, let's get into what we're gonna, what we're actually looking at right now. So, we're gonna start on the Q4 side, all right, guys? So let me just, here we go. So, we have uh, right there. Let me just put that in. All right, so this is Blaster Blade, you guys can see. Look at the artwork on it. Let me just get an extra zoom in. I want, I want you guys to actually see this. Just look how phenomenal that looks. Royal Paladins 
That um, Alfred Early, no, that's not even Early, I mean, um, that's, um, oh my, I said Alfred Early, Alfred Early, King of Night Alfred, King of Night Alfred, Alfred Early, you know. That is the King of Night, that's actually a Force Marker. That is a Force Marker. That is an epic, I love that Blaster Blade. I absolutely love that Blaster Blade, that looks so cool. All right, now we're gonna come to here. This needs to come down a little bit. All right, so now this is Nova Grapplers. I've actually, I actually got Nova Grapplers. I like Nova Grapplers. I've actually tinkered with the deck a few times and it looks cool. This is a Sura Kaiser. I don't look nothing. Oh, there's more, there's all gold on it and stuff. You guys can all see there's all like gold and all that stuff on there, which looks cool. I, don't, I've, I actually only w w run one of these in my uh, new setup. I'm gonna have to put that one in, that looks cool. And then we actually have, look at this. This is an Excel marker of Perfect Riser, look at that. That is so epic. That's insane. All right, now we have the one. Look, 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 look. Yo, Kagero right there. Dragonic Overlord. Look at Dragonic Overlord, guys. There's a bit of sellotape on it. I need to get that off, sorry. It's bugging me out. All right, here we go. Yo, hopefully the camera can focus. You guys can see that. Dragonic Overlord looks insanely epic. That is going in to my setup 100%. Then we have Waterfall over there as a, as a Force Marker. Yes, phenomenal. Then we come down here, then we got um, OTT. Amaterasu right there as the Grade 3 with more gold all over it. Doesn't look like nothing special. But then we got Imperial Daughter right there as a, a Protect Marker. That looks nice too. I like the gold, I like the gold. Can you guys actually see that? If I just do this, you guys can see, can you see the gold? If I do like that, you can see the gold right there, right? That's how you know the gold's in there, look. So it's normal, and if you do that, you can see the gold. Look at Waterfall, the gold all over it. You guys can all see that? But till you can see, look at Blaster Blade. Look at the gold, can you guys see the gold now? So look at normal, and then boom, gold's all there. The gold is everywhere. All right, now we come into L, 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 A, L4, sorry, man. I'm just, guys, I'm just so excited. I'm getting like tongue twisted and everything right now. And, uh, this right here, Shadow Paladins, Shadow Paladin, yo. And uh, we've got Blaster Dark, which I think Blaster Dark just looks insane. That is, that's definitely going in my setup right there. Then we have the epic Phantom Blaster Dragon with a Force Marker. That is so amazing. Oh, wow. Then we come down to Pale Moon. Pale Moon is actually, to be very honest with you, one of my most best Excel clans. You can get off like 11, 12 hits in one turn, which is, it's absolutely crazy. I absolutely love Pale Moon. You've got to wrap your head around how it actually works, but once you do, wow, wow. Phenomenal power coming your way. Um, now we go here, Murakumo. I like Murakumo. It locks up the other clan, which is really, really awesome. Like I said, can you see the gold if I do that? You can see the gold right there, which makes it look a little bit different. And it looks really, really cool. Love that. All right, so now we come down to dark irregular. Oh, my dog. How am I going to get this? I've got to do it like that. Because the camera, the camera stand is in the way. The camera, I'm going to have to put it at an angle, guys. Sorry. The camera stand is actually in the way. So these dark irregulars, at the moment, I I'm not really too sure if I'm liking dark irregulars. I actually um, decked out. I played it the other day and I decked out, which was, I've never decked out before in my life. So I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully some other cards come out for Dark Irregulars and uh, get to mess around with them. But there it is, guys. Look at that. AL4 right there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. The basically, I'll be honest with you guys. The best card out of this side, Blaster Dark, 100%. That is like, without a shadow of a doubt, that is the one right there. Blaster Dark. Look how cool it looks. I'm gonna get a zoom in now of this, just on its own, because that is like the best of the best. Look at this. Blaster Dark looks phenomenal. That looks crazy insane. Oh, all right. I'm basically gonna get, the ones I feel like I don't think like you need to look at, they're the ones I'm gonna get out. Everything else here, not really. Not really, it's just this one. It's just this one. I bought it for like this one right here. Then we come over to this side right here and uh, yo, blast the blade straight. Let me just make sure this sits down. Blast the blade right there. Nah. <laughs> ah, look at blast the blade. Yo, blast the blade looks phenomenal. Guys, look at that. 
That looks crazy. Look, can you see the gold? You can proper see, I like that. Some people don't like that, but I really like that. 100% going in my deck. Like, that is going in my deck straight away. That looks phenomenal. I love it. I absolutely love that. And then, um, Dragonic Overlord right here. This is, these are basically the three cards you actually buy this set for. Other than this, this looks phenomenal as well. If you don't really uh, have these three clans, to be honest, I'd say this whole set is actually kind of pointless. The three cards I've just shown you, let me just uh, get them side by side so you guys can actually see them. These are the cards you actually want, to be super honest with you. This, this is it, this is it. This is, the, this is the whole reason why you're gonna buy this set. Right here, this is the whole reason. Let me just, this is the whole reason why you're gonna buy it. Which ones do you think look the best? They look, they all look, they, no, they all look amazing. I like Overlord a lot. I really, I think Overlord might actually look the best, you know. I think Overlord could actually look the best. And they come with their own little sleeves and everything, which is awesome. Look at that. Oh, I can't wait to put, I, I want four and four and four. I want four of each. I need four of each, man, for my clans. I need them. I don't think it's gonna be possible but I definitely 100% need them for it. Um, all right, anyway, guys, so that was the uh, Q4 versus AL4 Collector's Edition right there. Uh, Vanguard unboxing. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. There's gonna be the Ultra Miracle Rare or something like that um, boosters coming uh, in about two weeks time. I'll be doing an unboxing of that as well. So if you love Vanguard, and you want to see what I'll get, do not forget to tune in for that unboxing as well. Uh, we hope you guys enjoyed this little uh, card showing right here because I'm so proud of this, man. Um, all right, until then, we'll see you guys in the next episode, dudes.